this is Robin Bremer, and uh, today I just want to share with you something that has been on my heart lately, and that is peace. If you listen to the news and you listen to the radio, you're not going to have peace, because that is what is happening in the world, and in the world, you're never going to have peace. It's just going to get worse and worse. So what I wanted to uh, share with you is a scripture that God gave me that I think is really cool. And that is a scripture that says, It's been given for you to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. Now that's a scripture that got me six books. I've, writ I've written six books and I'm on seventh and eighth right now. Or more. I, don't, I can't keep track. Um, <clears throat> anyway, confessing that scripture and believing that scripture has <clears throat> given me all the books that I've written. Because... God is teaching me about the kingdom. It's been given to, for me to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, the kingdom of God. And so, just recently, I'm saying, I, I, I've just, I, I'm a clown ventriloquist for 20 years, and I minister in churches, but just recently, <clears throat> God had me switch from being a clown ventriloquist, which I still do for churches and libraries, but to being a comic ventriloquist motivational speaker. So I use comic ventriloquism in motivational speaking and there's three points I give in my motivational speaking talk and number one is I'll get rid of the fear and number two is love yourself and number three is protect your heart and I do this speech uh, whether it's Christian or non-Christian it's the same speech it's just that I can add scripture to it and uh, it's a little bit better when it's a Christian speech because it's using but it's using the same kingdom principles but recently I know that so many people have so much fear because of the end time teaching and if I listen to the radio, in fact five to seven years ago, I don't remember when, five or seven years ago I turned off TV, never turned it back on, I don't watch TV, we don't have TV, we have computers, we watch Netflix, we watch um, Redbox, we rent Redbox and uh, we buy videos uh, and I watch some little clips on YouTube like ventriloquists and stuff like that but five seven years ago my church had a fast and I fasted TV and I never I fasted TV newspapers and magazines and I never went back thank God I didn't because they were causing me so much fear and so much stress and so when I cut that out I began to spend that same amount of time with God instead and in the word and out of that came six seven eight nine books and one thing recently, <clears throat> I had some things go on physically in my body and some things go on, some stressful things. And I said, God, where is this fear coming from? Where is this stuff coming up from? What is this from? And he showed me where it was from and he showed me some principles how to attack it. But one of the things he showed me that I am still getting revelation on and I know that it's going to be part of another part of the book is peace. The, and this scripture, he gave me the scripture, he says, The kingdom of God is not eating or drinking, but it's righteousness, peace, and joy in the Holy Spirit. And as I've already written in several of my books, uh, one-third of the kingdom is peace, one-third is joy, and one-third is righteousness, and it's all uh, in the Holy Spirit. So just recently, God had me confess, uh, it has been given for me to know the mysteries of peace in the kingdom of heaven. And so I've been confessing, I have peace like they do in heaven. I have joy like they do in heaven. I am righteous like they are in heaven. But mostly I have peace like they have in heaven. Peace in my body, peace in my mind, peace in my situations, no matter what's happening. And that scripture is becoming revelation knowledge to me. And he's developing that scripture and putting more on it. And I wanted to give you that scripture. It's been given to me to know the mysteries of the kingdom of heaven. And the kingdom of heaven is righteousness, peace, and joy. So it's been given to me to know the peace of the kingdom of heaven and so you can take that scripture and confess that scripture meditate on that scripture till it becomes revelation knowledge to you and till and the Holy Spirit is your teacher and he will open up the door and he will give you more and more teaching on that and so I want to share that scripture with you about peace and peace means nothing broken nothing missing and one of the other things that gives you peace is knowing that you are right with God no matter what you do or don't do and knowing you're right with God and you're not going to go to hell when you mess up. That you're not going to lose your salvation because you didn't gain it by your behavior or your obedience. 
you gain salvation by receiving a free gift with no strings attached, which is believing that Jesus died for your sins. You take that by faith, and that's how you stay saved, because you believe that Jesus died for your sins, and because he was obedient to death. And you take it all by faith, and that's righteousness. You're right with God now. So when you know who you are in Christ, you know you're right with God. You know your daddy loves you, and you're never going to be lost from your daddy. You can have joy, and you can have peace. So my name is Robin Bremer. .net is my website. Check it out. I pray that you have peace. In Jesus' name, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.